Hey guys, so today I need to pull an amp draw on this light fixture right here. Um, we've got several on a circuit and they are flashing whenever we first turn them on. So we're thinking they're pulling too many amps. So uh, I've got this AC line splitter with the GFCI tester here. And what this is going to do is we're going to plug our light into one end, plug the other end into a cord, and it's going to separate the hot and neutral, right? So let me get this open, and I'll get right back with you. So now that I have this AC line splitter by Racketeers open and out of the box, I want to show you the functions of this thing. Right here you have your standard outlet GFCI tester. This button will tr uh, trip your test button on your GFCI. This chart shows you correct wiring. And these two holes here, th these are a big factor in this AC line splitter. So this first hole, you see a X1. That's, that's times one. And this X10 is times 10. So the X1, you take your amp meter or your amp clamp and you wrap it around the X1 and you get the true times one reading of how many amps whatever you plug into this other end is pulling. So all it's doing is separating the hot and the neutral at, at this hole right here. But if you put your amp clamp around this back hole, it's going to multiply the amp draw times 10. So if you're only pulling in the decimals and you don't have that good of an amp meter, then you're going to want to multiply it by 10. So you measure right here. Now let's say you get 1.5 amps right here around this X10. Well, you know you can divide that by 10 and you get 0.15. So whatever this one says, divide it by 10 and this one will say. Also on this, you have a voltage test point. So you just take a regular multimeter and you stick your leads in any order you want to here. And uh, you're, that's going to show you voltage. Now it does not have those holes on the back. but uh, So you can measure voltage, amperage, and check your wiring all at the same time with this. And let me get, get the demonstration set up here and I'll show you how it works. For a straight measurement, you clamp around X1. For 10 times the actual draw, you clamp around X10. Now, another functionality of this is you can take a multimeter. You can take a multimeter, like this Klein that I've got right here. You can set it to voltage. You can take your test leads and you can put them down in these little holes. So you put one test lead in there and you put one test lead in there and bang you got measurements once you get your leads plugged in these two little holes then you have your voltage measurement so right now we're monitoring amps around the x1 function which is times one so this is the true measurement of amps for that light right there so that light is pulling 1.56, 1.57 amps. The circuit's providing 120 volts and the outlet is wired correctly. So there is all kinds of stuff that you can test right here. So if you got an outlet bad or, or you need to know how much your microwave pulls or, or some kind of device, this AC line splitter does it all and it's also reversible so you can use it from the back or from the front so hopefully this explains the ac line splitter um, it's mostly to measure amps and voltage and to check your wiring that's what this thing does so it's like a three-in-one tool hopefully this has been helpful to you guys um, down in the description you'll be able to find links to all the tools that we use today and uh as always thanks for watching uh thanks for all the subscribers if you're not a subscriber consider hitting the subscribe button uh it's the best way to help out our channel also so you don't miss any of our future videos and uh y'all have a great day and thanks for watching